toe squat is usually a bit of a challenge for most people, uh, but it's always nice to incorporate it uh, because it does affect all meridian lines of the body. A lot of lines start in the feet, uh, so getting as much open throughout the feet can really stimulate all the rest of the body. So it's nice to do this at the very beginning of practice, um, just to get that activation going. So one way that we can come into toe squat is to start off in tabletop position and tuck the toes underneath once you're here. Not always place a blanket underneath the knees here, it can be quite intense already. And try to get the pinky toe all the way underneath there as well. Some people won't be able to have anything close to anything more than the first couple of toes coming down into it. So the best that you can. So you can stay up in tabletop position and kind of just work on opening up through the toes like so, especially if they're very tight in the feet. And then also you can come standing a little bit uh, different sensation. You can lean back a little bit here. Or for the intensity, you can sit the hips all the way back towards the heels. So you're also welcome to sit on top of a block and have like a supported hero's pose here. So you're not coming all the way down, you're not adding the extra weight of the hips on top of the heels, but there is a, a intensity. And you can also sit all the way down into them, really try to get a good foundation there. You can also do any variations of the arms, uh, more or less just for a distraction from the toes. And I will repeat it again, it can be pretty intense for people. So really not holding anything longer than a minute or two. And when you are ready, you can slowly come up out of the posture. Lift the feet up, tap the top of the feet down in towards the ground. One way to counter pose is to bring the big toes to touch, sink the hips down, come into child's pose, and or come into an ankle stretch. This pose naturally does an ankle stretch, so it's a, a good uh, counter pose for the toe squat.